Hello, this is Tom from Tabletop Tap Room. A little bit of a sad duty today. We have to sadly review the entitled personality. And uh, before we get too, too deep into it, let me just say thanks for watching the video. Thanks to my subscribers. Guys are great. Don't forget that like, subscribe, and bell icon. The definition of an entitled personality, um, or entitled mentality, is defined as a sense of deservingness or being owed a favor when little or nothing has been done to deserve special treatment. Uh, it's the you owe me attitude. Entitlement is a narcissistic personality trait. Mental health professionals have studied this mentality of totally stark raving narcissists. Uh, so if you know someone with an entitlement mentality, you should encourage them to solve their raucous spirit uh, and maybe seek help. The National Mental Health Hotline is actually 866-903-3786. Uh, I'll put that in the show notes and maybe in a ticker across the bottom of the video. Uh, some symptoms of the entitlement mentality would be a possibly a brief military career with high notes like go sweep the mo motor pool floor uh, and the individual will will tend to hide their separation rank because they're embarrassed by it stolen valor sometimes is a feature because they feel entitled to more military honors than they deserve so they inflate their record most veterans don't feel the need to participate in totally stolen respect, uh, but the entitled narcissist craves it. Uh, they might engage in a totally simple-minded run for office and lose. Uh, they expect to win without doing any real work um, to influence uh, people or expect they, they expect to be worshipped simply because they exist. Those who uh, those will lose time over time sucking repeatedly, then rage quitting a political party doing the John Belushi. Who's with me? Who's with me? Let's go. Come on. Ah! And no one goes with them. So they go back to the party to suck on a redo election. They might try to start a ripoff of a company with a nostalgic name and expect the masses to flock to them like a messiah, but fail by doing totally stupid routines of business geared to fleece and not provide value. They rage and attack anyone who questions them or criticizes them because an entitled mentality only reacts with anger to anyone not recognizing their entitlement. They like to keep hate or enemy lists or their slate of rivals. Might succeed at attracting two or three sycophantic retinue, but these people are simply leeches. They can or will imagine themselves a savior and religious leader, uh, but there is no substance to their religious delusions and their religious delusions go nowhere. The defining note of their self-promoted religious position is pretty much arrogance and hypocrisy. They can imagine themselves as superior to the rank and file of the rest of us. They're above the law. Pay sales taxes? That's for lesser mortals, uh, at least until the Revenue Department hands down a judgment for thousands of dollars. They scheme to rip off others. Uh, to pay for their mistakes. And in the end, they transpose their sins to really innocent people uh, for why they fail, because that is what a narcissist does. Their failures are never their fault. In the end, they become totally stupid rejects, rejected by everyone, their tribe, sycophants, and relatives. They subsist reviled by society, miserable with no solace from their silver resources or accomplishments. It is truly sad to review the entitled personality. This is Tom from Tabletop Tap Room uh, reviewing the totally entitled personality. 
just because maybe somebody's out there reimagining themselves as some sort of religious or social messiah, and you should be warned. So these are the, the symptoms and the definition of this personality, so you can take care and avoid it. Keep on gaming, and thanks for watching the video.